Hello and welcome to Maurice JTV and today we've got another reaction. Uh, I'm going to react to a, a really talented artist um, who's currently coming up in the UK now. Um, he's been doing this a long time. Uh, he's the way he he writes his lyrics is 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 so different to uh, what we hear a lot today. It's all, almost like listening to somebody who wrote lyrics say 10, 20 years ago, where the lyrics, uh, you know, he's not firing a, a lo he's not firing the dictionary at you at 90 miles an hour. He's giving you a story, his experience. Uh, one thing I know about G.R. Joe is um, he, he doesn't tend to really write things down on paper. It, it all comes from his head. He writes in his head a little bit like, uh, I think Jay-Z does the same thing. Jay-Z uh, says that he does that. He tends to write in his head as opposed to on paper. Um, you know, he, he, he what's different about G.R. Joe is he's not giving you these grimy um, beats. He's giving you acoustic. He plays the guitar. He's able to sing with the guitar and rap to the guitar. Um, and what's great is, as I know when I say that, a lot of people probably think Ed Sheeran. He's not like Ed Sheeran. Yes, he plays the guitar. Yes, he sings. Yes, he raps. But this guy, G.R. Joe, he's talking about real, real life, everyday experiences. This is a guy who's still, you know, still grinding to put food on the table. And, you know, and, and he's out there putting his talent out there. He's recently uh, done a show in Liverpool. Um, he does do quite a few shows in his local area and surrounding areas. Um, he's been on radio uh, quite recently as well. And he's been do he did some work with uh, a group called Fractured Planet. And uh, if you go and check out his channel, I'll leave a link in the description to his channel so you can go check out some of his other videos. Now, his new channel is quite fresh, so there might won't, might not be a ton of content, but the content on there is, is great. And if you type in Gio Joe in search, you'll see um, links to his old album, Broken Streets. Um, but yeah, I, I do think this guy needs uh, recognition, which is why I'm doing this video today. I do think people need to check this guy out. Um, he's very relatable, he's very real very talented so let's uh, have a look at this this is a little something he done i believe in his local area he lives in hastings um i believe this is by the seafront so he's just doing a like a nice little mellow three minute video here of uh, his acoustic um and his and his and his bars let's check him out yeah. see obviously he, he doesn't just play the guitar he plays it well you know he plays it really well um he grew up playing you know guitar and and, and making music he's been jesus man i mean i could go back probably nearly 20 years ago and and he had an interest in in in, in rapping you know and he's uh you know his father plays a guitar so he's obviously grown up knowing quite a lot about playing guitars, and yeah, he just he the way he blends all these these different styles together is fantastic. Hastings Seaside. They say that money is the root of all evil. What about people? What about people? See straight away, straight away. That everybody says the money's the root of all evil, but he's saying, what about people? There's some nasty people out there. At the end of the day, people created money. And uh, it's people that, that do evil things in the name of, um, in the name of money. So what he's saying is true. You hear 
that moon tide connection you know you know the, 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 the gravity pull of the moon controls the tide that's sick guidelines trying to see between the white lines but this white line's got me feeling tipsy again i'm feeling risky praying that somebody's actually gonna fucking hit me because i'm no better and i ain't no better than you you ain't no better than me and i ain't no better than you you know, I love the way he's just casually doing this on the seafront, just sitting on the wall. It's not like he's sectioned the place off. He's just sat down and started doing this in the middle of, you know, in the middle of broad daylight. And that's, that's a real artist, you know. I mean, if you've got the money and the fame and, and, and the following, you can go and shut down anywhere you like and just do stuff like this. You know, people, art, artists have been on roofs of buildings and you know, uh, performed for the people down and, and, it, and it's all sick, but he's just literally just gone down to the seafront, pulled the guitar and just busted this out and that takes balls and takes a lot of balls. So I take my head out the clouds, bring it back down to the ground, and I'll show you how it goes down. What a powerful sound, pound for the pound, reload it, pound for the pound. Yeah. Show you how it goes down, oh, what a powerful sound, pound for the pound. Every day I pray to God, I'm looking up at the ceiling. Calling him a fiend cause I'm battling my demons Can't get even Steven, so I'm rolling out my heathens Trying to find a balance up with my feelings It's like I'm grieving and my heart's bleeding I hold it down like my last beating Some of my mates are on the ground and I'm still breathing For them Did you hear that connection there? Where he connected beating Following his, his, his bar about the heart It's gone out of my head now exactly what he said but he was talking about his heart bleeding and then he's gone on about his next beating 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 that's sick i can't better than that so i wrote a fucking album just to come out my shack i'll be like amy winehouse if i go back to black one sniff of that shit's just as good as the crack you see i've got the whole weight of the world on my back either the drink or the drugs or my name on a black but um i ain't no better than you See, the, the, the whole message there, everything ties in, everything that you're saying ties in, you know, the uh, people people fight over. We're very materialistic, uh, especially today, and we've, we've become, every decade we've become more, more materialistic than the last decade, and, you know, Harry started out talking about the money is the root of all evil, you know, it's not really the money, it's the people. Um, we make everything the root of all evil. It's the way that we res we respond to, to to situations, and we use money as the scapegoat, and we'll do anything to get the money, whether that be you know causing distress to other people. Look at the world today. Most of the people who are in these problems, either because of money or because of what someone did for money, and you see how he's led on. And if you listen to the the hook, he's talking about. Uh, you know, we're not better than each other. You're not better than me, I'm not better than you. We're all human. Um, it's the message that he's putting out there is 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 basically, you know, we need to we need to have more respect around, we need to value each other, we need to stop the BS over silly s silly things like money and material, you know. <laughs> that was great that was that was really sick what he did there because obviously oxide neutrino were a, a garage uh, group back in the day they were you know they were uh, connected with the so solid crew in the uk the uk ga uh, garage scene and obviously they had a track bound for the reload and then he talks about Machino. Everyone wore Machino back then. I think they actually uh, was the guys that got everyone uh, to wear Machino. And then obviously he took Shino to Shino's. That's good. 
I to get Monopoly, dog got it in muscle rebro, all I'm legal. Can't stop me, it's a free globe where I'm from, you try to stop me, you can get your knees broke, and that's not an ego in the southeast on my beast, bro. Well, there you have it. That was G.R. Joe um, performing on the, on the wall in Hastings by the beach, the beach, the sea wall. And uh, as you can see, you know, you haven't got to always go to mainstream artists to find where the lyrics are at or where the content's at. Because to be honest, you know, uh, some of his bars there were far, far, far more fire than some of the hottest tracks out right now, selling selling record after record after record. And and this is why I think people like this need more recognition. I loved 2018. I think 2018 was more about lyrics. You know, we saw a lot of um, a lot of people making more lyrical content last year. Um, it got a little, before, prior to, to, to 2018, it was riddled with like mumble rap and, you know, this really, really cheap trap music and, um, I mean, the UK was all right, but the I think the UK, uh, they're starting to imitate each other on the grime scene and the drill scene. And it's nice to see, you know, artists like this who, you know, are not trying to sort of make a point, like a street point. He's not trying to, you know, sell millions and millions of records and get the crowd bumping. He's trying to get you to listen to his story and respect his musical musical ability to, to tell that story. And I'm gonna leave a link in the description to his channel. I think you should subscribe, I think you should check him out and you should see his other content. He's been doing, he's been really, really active, I'd say over, especially over the past six months, six to eight months, he's been extremely active. So I think go, go like his videos, go subscribe, check him out. You know, Google search his name, YouTube search his name. He's been doing this a long time. Uh, yeah. So, thanks for watching Maurice JTV today. I hope you really liked this uh, reaction. Uh, if you did, please like, please subscribe, share with your friends. And thanks for watching.